So I wanted to show everybody what this inverter comes with. Um, I got this one, I'm putting together a box just in case, kind of in case of emergency. I initially wanted the generator, um, not out of our price range, but for the, what we're gonna get out of it. Um, I figured an inverter to run off of a car battery would be much better. I actually have one of these in the bed of my truck, all wired up, and I love having the inverter there. It's awesome for tailgates, camping, whatever. But in case of an emergency situation, I think you should have one at home. I might put in there, you know, candles, a crank radio, um, a little bit more than a basic emergency kit. And then this mounted on the outside of the box, ready to hook up. Um, it did come with leads that are about, um, here we go. Let me get a measurement on those. Oops. Let's see, trying to get it around. About 20 inch leads. Um, they didn't come with covers, uh, which is interesting, but two fans, your AC outputs here um on off switch your L lcd indicator nice detail they could have just put a piece of um a piece of plastic over this however this is nice and beveled i thought that was a nice little touch especially if it's going to be mounted on the outside of my box um two bolt holes on each side so it could be screwed or bolted in the box i might uh drill that out and make them a little thicker but it is on a hefty hefty i mean you're not bending that uh, your two ac ports um but what I didn't see was I saw a full measurement of the box it shipped in, but not a measurement of this, which was very important to me. It's going to work perfectly, but um, you got almost tw uh, 11, I'm sorry, 12, 12 and a half inches. So foot, foot, half, foot, one foot and a half an inch right here, right? Uh, let's do it from the widest point. About eight and a quarter inch, and then height wise. At the maximum, let's get it right here and get it. You can see that probably just to stick out about three and a quarter, uh, three and a half actually, just under three and a half. So I'll give you guys another look on this side, a close up. Again, no covers, uh, I don't, but whatever, um, should be fine. The base is just there. Your AC outputs, your USB. Slim, nice looking, clean design, which is exactly what I want. It's kind of an emergency box. I don't know if it has a rate on these fans. The ratio XDR brushless, so that's good. Fans to keep everything cool. So let me give you guys another. I take this off here, give you a little close up of everything. Um, nice that they included washers and crush washers here. They're not all the way tightened. Once I get my whole setup going, I'll, I'll probably take a picture. Again, 20 inch leads, um, pretty good. And did include a few fuses. Cool.